I decided to put Nikola Jokic on every single NBA team. As you can see, we're here on NBA 2K24. We're going through every single roster here and at the top of every single roster, we do have Nikola Jokic on top of it for every single team. Now, I just want to see how things would play out here on NBA 2K24 with obviously now a three-time MVP in Nikola Jokic here, the Joker as you will. He's going to be playing for every single NBA team and whatever team ends up winning the championship in today's video is going to go home as the victor. Now, something that you potentially be asking is, are there two Jokic's on the Nuggets? So no, I just kept the Nuggets roster as this because obviously there's already Jokic on the roster, of course. So every single other roster here, such as Pacers, Pelicans, for example, they each have a Jokic now on their squad. I just want to highlight a couple teams that I think have a much higher odds at winning a championship this season. Uh, it's definitely not the Detroit Pistons, although I think one of these teams that are like bad teams like Pistons, Blazers, Wizards, Jokic on that team probably is going to win that MVP because he's going to have really ridiculous numbers here. The Spurs with the Jokic and Victor should be pretty interesting. However, you know, I don't think they're going to really make too much noise. The Phoenix Suns, though, I do think are pretty interesting to say this because now they have Jokic, Durant, and Booker on the squad here. So that's going to be one of the teams that we definitely should be watching out for. Of course, the Thunder as well. The Thunder obviously are a very, very good team in the NBA. But now you're adding three-time MVP Nicole Jokic on through Ross here. Anything is possible here. So it'll be interesting to see how that plays out. Timberwolves as well. Although it'll be interesting to see how that plays out. Obviously, with Jokic being a center and they already have two bigs in Towns and Gobert. Blazers have no chance to worry. So Jokic and Curry probably won't be enough to get the job done. And the shout out to the best duo, Kuzma and Jokic. <laughs> And Bede and Jokic on the same team, though, that's going to be pretty interesting, to say the least. Uh, one of them probably played a four. Obviously, the other's going to play a five. Uh, but that one, I don't really know how that's going to go down. But, you know, we'll find out shortly. Of course, Jokic and Giannis on the same squad as well, along with Lillard and Middleton. That's going to be playing a factor in this. The Bulls, I don't really think they have a chance. Cleveland, though, the Cleveland's got a solid team, but I don't really know about that. The Celtics, of course, Celtics are already stacked. You're putting Jokic on the team. I mean, <laughs> I the Celtics definitely are going to be one of the clear head runners for this, along with the Clippers here. Grizzlies, probably not. Uh, Hawks, no. Heat, I doubt it. Hornets, <laughs> probably not. Jazz, no. Kings, probably not. The Knicks have been really good in real life, but putting Jokic on the team, we'll see how that happens. Of course, one of the last options here. Uh, the Lakers, obviously, with LeBron, AD, are in the squad, and you're putting Jokic on the team, too. That's going to be playing a huge factor in this. And the other team I want to talk about is the Dallas Mavericks here with Jokic, Luka, and Kyrie on the squad. This big three is definitely going to be playing a huge role in today's video. So, without any further ado, I'm going to catch up you guys at the end of the season here we're gonna be simulating this entire season with Nikola Jokic literally on every single NBA team let's see how the NBA has changed I'll see you guys shortly in the season here Lucas still wins MVP despite all these Jokic's an insane season say the least Victor rookie of the year Davis sixth man of the year that's pretty interesting Victor also won defensive player of the year Paul Reed as your most approved player this year and Jokic close player of the year with the Los Angeles Lakers four Jokic's on the first team along with Luka Doncic on the Warriors Nuggets Cavs and Wizards here all Jokic here on the second team jazz bulls kings sixers and heat and on the third team here nets suns clippers thunder uh shay actually made on thunder and blazers Jokic on third team so at the end of the season here there's a whole bunch of Jokic's, of course in the scoring department like towards the top of the league here Jokic on the worst actually led the most out of all the Jokic's at 30 and a half there nuggets Jokic still up there of course uh, this Jokic you'll see on the balls though 28 points a game pretty interesting to say right there the jazz was 26.6 Cavs 26.5 and look at all this it's pretty crazy look at all this all, entire list though 14 through what 22 all Jokic's. that's crazy in the rebounding department and the same thing first in the league was Jokic on the Warriors though it looks like he probably had the best season out of all the Jokic's this season 30 points 12 rebounds and eight assists uh let's see in the assist department Luka Harden then Jokic on the Pelicans actually 10.4 dimes and uh 10 dimes a game for the Cavs so this one actually averaged a triple double so shout out this Jokic here interesting to say the least uh in the Western Conference though uh with the Kings were actually the first seed here 51 and 31 Thunder still up, up top there Clippers there Pelicans were better Mavs were the 60 Lakers seventh and the Warriors eighth though it was it the Nuggets are not even a playing team though the Nuggets weren't even making at all that's pretty interesting let's check the actual stats and everything because i'm kind of curious because let's see what were the nuggets the nuggets were 12th this year actually even so this is a normal Jokic squad i all the, i mean all the other teams improved though because i got a Jokic on their squad i mean we stayed the same because well we didn't get a new Jokic. but the kings were 51 31 and out east though if i am able to click correctly the atlanta hawks is always the hawks so if you put Jokic on the hawks i mean they're best now 58 and 24 caps up there heat bucks next six or celtics the celtics were 
on the seventh seed this season. What in the world? How are the Celtics? You put Jokic on the team only seven seed. That's crazy. And unfortunately, though, the uh, Nets did not do very good out in the Eastern Conference, though. And uh, neither did the uh, Wizards, Pacers, Blazers. I mean, the, they were worst team only at 25 games uh, that winning. They won only 25 games, but still not the best. But either way, I mean, so let's see how this goes down here. Uh, in the playing game over here, we got the Lakers, Warriors here, Jazz, Grizzlies. Now East, I can only have the Celtics and the Bulls, though. Well, the Celtics mix is more shocking, to say the least. But the Raptors, Pistons, I'm Pistons, I'm improved here. You never know. So we have the playing game here. Celtics do make it. Uh, we got the Kings, Lakers, Pelicans, Suns here, Clippers, Mavs, Thunder, Warriors here. Let's see after the first round here. Uh, Jokic on his new squads, what is going to happen here between them all and and the Los Angeles Lakers, though, they defeat the first seed Kings here. So the Lakers, Jokic uh, team there, right there. I'm kind of curious to see how this goes down here. Jokic, LeBron, they have AD coming off the bench. Oh, my God. They're having AD coming off the bench. That's ridiculous there. But they're taking off against the Phoenix Suns squad there. Obviously, with Booker, Beal, Durant, and Jokic. This is a very stacked starting lineup. They got ball ball, too. The Thunder and the Clippers here are already two stacked teams here. Put Jokic on the squad. They're even better, of course. And the Clippers, I mean, the Clippers, a hardened man, Paul George, Kawhi Leonard, Jokic, Zubac, Peyton Pritchard's on the team now. It looks like they don't have uh, Westbrook anymore. That's pretty interesting. But, hey, they're still stacked here. Out east, the Atlanta Hawks. is Obviously, the Hawks are just amazing with Jokic on here. I don't know why he's number 53, but either way, uh, they're taking off against the Bucks, the Cavs, and the Sixers down here. The Cavs, I told you before, the Cavs have a very uh, well-rounded team, so they're going to be playing a big factor in this and this Embiid Jokic pairing I mean that's something to say the least uh, let's go uh similar the next round here let's see what teams come out on top and it's gonna be the Clippers and the Suns they're out in the Western Conference and then the Hawks and the Sixers out east but similarly another round very quickly here to say the least and it's gonna be the Clippers here Western Conference Finals MVP is Jokic 24 11 and 11 of course and in the Eastern Conference it's actually Trey Young though 31 and 12 this season for Mr. Trey Young right there the Hawks and the Clippers here in the NBA finals there with obviously Jokic on both squads uh, let's see how this goes down I'm kind of curious though I, I think the Hawks might win though because the Hawks love because 2k loves the Hawks 32 7 10 for Jokic in this one here Paul George 38 Jokic had 25 10 8 for the Clippers there but the Hawks are up 1-0 game two here the Clippers come right back Trey Young 33 and 15 here Jokic with 29 16 and 15 in this one for Atlanta 22 20 and 15 for Jokic here a 151 to 147 what a very competitive series so far to say the least and in game number four here or game number three I should say Clippers go up 2-1 here only a four point victory Jokic getting the job done 30 six seven and four right here 29 16 and 11 for Jokic on atlanta right there game number four here the hawks come right back to it you can't count any of them out she only had 16 8 and 7 in this one though Jokic on the hawks though 22 8 and 15 i mean this is gonna have some bad games here clippers uh lose this one here as the hawks go up 3 2 here 22 12 and 8 for Jokic there and uh, this joke's only at 14. Wow. We're going to game number six here. And we're going to game seven, actually. I do want to get some game action, though, because I'm kind of curious to see how this goes down here. So I'm going to see you guys in game, and let's hope for the best. So we're here in game seven, actually, of the NBA Finals here. And there's already an illegal screen on DeJounte Murray, to say the least. But either way, Paul George coming into this game. We have the Clippers are currently up two over the Atlanta Hawks. And I did make sure that both uh, Jokic is on both teams are in the game because obviously you know 2k always has some issues like they don't put the players in the game but here's Jokic on the Clippers here he's got the ball guarded by Jokic on the Hawks though pretty interesting to say the least Jokic going into the paint and he's gonna get fouled by his other Jokic counterpart there number 53 though I have no idea why he's uh, wearing 53 I mean I guess they probably made him wear that because Capello was 50 or 15 before but either way Jokic there he's gonna hit the first free throw for the Clippers and he's gonna hit the second one as well putting the Clippers up by four here in game seven there's still two minutes left on the clock there's still a lot that can go down here in this ball game but either way Trey Young he's got the ball here there's been a lot of rumors that Trey Young getting traded in real life so I can't wait to see how that goes down too because you never know what's going to happen with that I do want to get to, to the Spurs though I think it'd be interesting however I'm, I don't really think he's going to trade to the Spurs Jokic though he's got the ball guarded by Jokic of course he's going to hit him with the hook shot and it is good back to a two point ball game here that Jokic on the Hawks 21 points so far on 47% field goal percentage here in game 7 of the NBA Finals Jokic on the Clippers he's calling for the ball from James Harden but James Harden's got the ISO on Trey Young and with 
the step back to Hezzy going into the paint and hits off Trey Young with the rebound here. What's he going to do on this end? 43 boards for the Hawks tonight. Okay. Trey Young going into the paint with the floater and it's off. That's a huge miss for Trey Young right there. Harden come back up from the paint. What's he going to do? He kind of just stopped right there from pretty interesting. Uh, uh, let's see. Norm Powell coming over to set the screen here. Harden with the ball. He's going to pass it inside to Jokic. Do they hit him with the double team? They do somewhat. Pack it out to Harden in the corner over to Norman Powell with the ball. We got five seconds left on the winding shot clock here. He's going to hit over to Harden. Harden has going to he's going to have to shoot it right there. And it is off. A huge miss for James Harden there. 45 seconds here left on the clock in this ball game. DeJounte Murray going into the paint for the Atlanta Hawks. And it is good. Assist by Jokic. We're up to a tie game here. 42 seconds here left on the clock. Again, whoever wins this ball game is going to go home with the Larry O'Brien trophy here. 40 seconds here left on the clock. Harden with the ball. Jokic with the screen Harden with the fading jumper and it's off Jalen Johnson with the board here bringing up is DeJounte Murray for Atlanta here they just need one bucket here they're gonna give it over to Trey Young are they gonna pass to Jokic though I don't know uh Trey Young he's still got the ball he's still got his dribble that he can do Jokic can always set the screen there that's gonna be a good play Trey Young with the mid-range jumper it's off but Jokic on the offensive rebound right there a huge slam for Nicole Jokic on the Atlanta Hawks he's thrilled of course he is he's thinking about his horses back home 17 seconds here left on the clock in this ball game so we've got 17 seconds here left in this ball game paul george is going to be inbound the ball for the los angeles clippers here the clippers have to get a three if they want to win two to tie we have 10 seconds here left in this ball game Jokic going into the paint right there he's going to get the pass in from Harden. here comes the double team by murray out in the corner to paul george for three and it is good paul george with a huge three pointer right there with 2.7 seconds here left on the clock what a big shot right there by pg 13 2.7 seconds here left on the clock between these two squads there. A bucket has to be made by Atlanta if they want to win this game. Sadiq Bay inbounding the ball over to Jalen Johnson. He's going to hoist up the three-pointer, and it goes in and out. It is off. The Los Angeles Clippers have won the NBA championship. A huge three by Paul George right there. But either way, Jokic is thrilled, of course. Of course he is. The Los Angeles Clippers with Nikola Jokic on their squad have won the NBA championship here in the simulation. So if you were able to put Nikola Jokic on every single NBA team. The team that's going to come out on top is the Los Angeles Clippers. So, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Please should like, subscribe for your content. Uh, if you want me to do any other players and put them on every single other team, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below. But if not, I hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you next time.